This is Die Sporting Network. What, what, what. Work it back to Upper Thompson, the Oil Blakefield, and the big matchup with the sixth ranked team in the country, the Boy Flat Lakers. And the Lakers overcoming Spartan early, able to get the job done on Friday evening. Lawyer Blakefield and the new field on the other side was able to beat John Kell on Friday evening, but this one today, and they know the history, as recent history, as you've seen a year ago, the playoff matchup as the Lakers get it first. At least we have a Laker in contention for the playoffs, unlike in the NBA. <laughs> we just learned that it's only going to be six teams in the MIA Conference playoffs, which, I mean, you want to talk about it's already the toughest conference in America to begin with. That one went wide there, yeah, the Lakers will retain possession. Well, it's already a tough conference as it is. Six teams only get in. I think there's at least five teams ranked nationally in the MIA conference. You talk about a war of attrition. These games are bigger and more important now than they've ever been. As the Don, three and three in conference play. Roy Blakefield trying to continue their run. Setting up the showdown next week in Paschal Field against St. Mary. Coming, shoots from behind, and a nice block at goal. Number 13, we got to see him against Georgetown Prep. Brennan Wright. As the Dons should be on offense here for the first time. And weather here, really the only day this week that rain will play a factor. It was very raining about 40 minutes before this one. That heavy rain has stopped. We're hoping the rain will hold off for this one. I must say a large contingent of boys Latin fans here as the two teams not far away. The boy Latin is in the edge of Baltimore County in the city, right in the county line. And Roy Blakefield here in Towson. We learned that the one and two seeds will get a bye in the first round. Them two quarterfinal matches, how huge would they be? Well, we spoke up some rain, a little drizzle now coming. If it's light like this, we should be okay. If it gets heavy, that's where it becomes a little bit of a problem. Look in here. Nice pass over. Look in. As the rain has picked up some now. to nothing here so far. Try to shield you from the rain here, at least the camera anyway. Well, don't call me a weatherman, I was a jinx. Face off, ball rolling. It should go back to boys lighting it well. Rain again is picked up. And this key MIA conference matchup, the other big matchup with Gilman against Calvert Hall, a big one there. The game of the week, I think, because of the threat of weather, not bringing that one. To the folks, you can see it on the Gilman YouTube channel. They do a great job over there. Dawn's in that yellow. Shoots! Score! Oh, what a goal! Amazing goal by Hopper Severino, the senior. We're tied at one. Woo. I mean, that was a hot shot right in there. And Wright played it well. It wasn't his fault. It just went right through him. We are tied at one here between these two rivals here at Lawyer Blakefield. That's the rain. Continues to pick up here a little bit. Face off. Dons as the ball rolls there. They get it, popped in the air. 
Still popped around. That ball's rolling. That ball's rolling. Hit a 50. Don's got it. Oh, intercepted. Check there. Ball still down. Rolling there. Ooh, look out. Oh, trip from behind. That's a flag. Flag against boys like Don's will have a penalty. As the Don's try to regain the lead here. 8.40 left in the first quarter. We expect four quarters of Bury in this matchup here in Towson. Well, last time we was at Lloyd Blakefield, they had an overtime thriller against Georgetown Prep. And by the way, Georgetown Prep was ranked nationally. They started to yell, they had a loss to Gilman. Coming here. Over, breaks the D. Oh, shot. The pass went wide. And the Dons will keep possession. Here, that's the shot clock down to 18. Last couple games for me, I haven't had the shot clock, so it's good to have it back. Here in this one. Get on lacrosse side, we're hoping to. Don't have an answer yet. We will be Friday night. We will be somewhere. No likelihood. Look like St. Mary's will be the target again. We'll have them against Gilman. And again, with only six teams making the MIAA conference playoffs, whew, it's going to be a battle. No doubt about it. It's going to be a battle. Back. Extra man advantage here. 16 seconds on it. They swing it back around. Looking back. Nice second. Shoots. Nice save in the middle. 99. Cardin Stroller, the senior. With it. Back. Looking. And boys, Latin tries to take the lead for the first time. In the game, in the postseason game last season, the Lakers didn't have a lead until the fourth quarter. The very end of the fourth quarter, I got. That was a short pass there. And the Don scoop it up. Ball knocked out. It stays with Boys Latin. Boys Latin keep possession. They swing it back around. Time's here, looking, looking. Looking back, over. Shot clock at 65. Couple checks. Looking back over. Coming with the noise is Petramala. Shoot, score! Straight shot in there! Tom Petramala with the thunder and the heat there. And it's a 2 1 lead for the Lakers. What a shot. These, these two goals have been unbelievable by Boyd Latin. I tell you. Petromala, the senior, with some heat there. The Dons down a goal now. As Boyd Latin has scored two unanswered, and they win the faceoff. The sixth ranked team in the country. Quick feet. That skipped in the air. And that oh, he's going to stay with Boyd Latin. Shot clock at 76. The game clock at 6.33 left in the first. What a bomb burner of a game here. Looking, looking. Back. St. Murray's at John Carroll as we speak in this one. We'll get some updates for you. Long pass. Shoots! Right with a block. Boys Latin had it. The ball came out. Checking it. Oh, that's a flag. That's a flag. That's against Lloyd. Flag against the Dons. Nobody tell how that one was going to go. So it's going to be an uh, advantage. Let's see for Boys Latin. Let's see for how many seconds or minutes. Again, the rain has intensified here at uh, in Towson. It's going to be a 30-second penalty. 
as the Lakers will have man advantage for 30 seconds. Blocked. And boys, Ladden get it back here. Penalty at 15 seconds. The pass work here from the Lakers, impressive. Right on the money. In attack mode, Petramala. Nice high pass, shoots! And it's skipped wide. Stays with the Lakers. The penalty has a spot. Shot clock at 44. Looking straight. Score! Right in the middle. The Lakers up 3 to 1. Right in the middle there. What a goal. Three unanswered here from the Lakers here in the first quarter. The sixth ranked team in the country. Going wise. Rain continues to drop down. Face off. Ball popped out. Looked like the Lakers get it. They do. Whoa, the referee had to get out the way. He almost took a tumble. Nice password. Back. Over. Scores. Oh, it's giving a double. Oh, slam. Bam. Slicky. And it's the Lakers oh, with a fast start in this one. They're up for a while. That was powerful. A little slam, bam, slicky right there. The nice password. Let's go one Set six. that one up. And the Lakers with four unanswered, up four to one. But remember, the Warriors started off like this in the postseason game you too, a season ago. You too. And we've seen Boys Latin come back, so lacrosse, no lead is safe. Going back to the Lakers again, they win another. So the faceoffs have been huge here. The Lakers have controlled them. They've been able to control the game here so far. Five minutes there left in the first quarter. Like each other, actually. Coming back. Shoots! That's skip wide. Ball stays with the Lakers. I'm sorry, the Dons get it back. They so went out on the Lakers. Let's see if the Dons can set something up on offense. They haven't been able to see their side of the attack in a while. That one skipped. That's a roller. There's a roller. Lakers get it back. Make it easy. Right, back. This is where the Lakers are dangerous. Long pass. Coming back around the edge. Back over. That pass was errant. Really the first earned pass of the game here for the Dons. Excuse me. For the Lakers, the Dons get it back. Looking. Pass in the middle. It's a nice pass there. Dons in attack mode. Trying to get this game back down to two again. Coming around the edge here, shot clock at 54 seconds. Dons in the yellow today. Boys Latin in the maroon. Looking back. Back, shoots! Nice save! Oh, very nice save there. Here comes the Lakers. A scoop from under. They swing it back around. Good work, Connor. Low pass there. 250 left in the quarter. Dons have controlled the quarter here so far. Looking, shoots and score! Right in there. That was a 
nice shot. Number three, Braden Garland, the senior. The midi. This is a timeout by Lori Blakefield. The Dons in a hole right now. At home. They're down five to one. Back here to game action, the Dons trying to calm the natives here. Down by by four goals here, five to one. And the first couple of goals was, for Boys Latin was, man, was unbelievable. That's couple been pretty calm and, and things have been breaking down here for the Dons, which at five and six, they're three and three in the conference. Right now with only six teams making the postseason, we're gonna get full word on that. Ball popped out. Make it easy, make it easy. Had to go over. Whoop, that drop. Boys Latin now got some numbers here. Lane has taken the fall steadily. And now there's been no problem for Boys Latin in this one. Up by four goals. Pass back. Pachamala with it. Whoop, fakes. Looking for a high pass. Don's defense out of the timeout's been a little better. Lots of time. Shot clock at 28. Back! The pass. It's gonna roll to Don's. Won't be able to get it. Lakers do retain it with 20 seconds left. Back. Over in the middle. Spins. Hit right there. No boom action. Shot clock. As the ball rolled there, and the Dons did it back. Pass in the middle. Ooh, what a... Yeah, very clean. 106 remaining. That's the Lakers. Petromalo trying to get a second. Spins! Woo! Guiding win there. And the ball will... Stay with the Lakers here, the shot clock at 71. Will not matter because the game clock is at 59.4 seconds here left in the first. Should be the last shot of the quarter. Last attempt of a shot, that is. What's the Lakers want to get something going now? High pass. Shoots! And it skipped wide. This should stay with the Lakers. It will. Game clock at 36.8. Looking. Spins. Pass over. Tipped in the air. And the Dons get it with 16 seconds left. Let's see if I can do something quick. Ball came out at the end of that. Got it back. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Throws it up. I thought it was going to go over the upright, but it didn't. After one. Boys lighting on to a fast start. The sixth ring team in the country. Up five to one here at Loyola Blakefield. The second quarter in this DMV Spring Sports Series matchup. Here in the MIA Conference to come. Second quarter about to get on the way tomorrow. I start here with you. And up at Towson and Lawyer Blakefield at home down five to one here. Second quarter begins. And that one plucked everywhere. Who's gonna get the ball? Ball still on the ground. Ooh, and Don's get it. And like I said, we're only six teams making the MIA conference 
playoff. It is huge. Ball back to Boys Latin there. The play resumes. Lawyer scored the first goal, and the Lakers have scored five straight cents. Look and shoots. Right. Nice way to get a stop there. Rain's actually slacking up a little bit here now. A little bit. I actually see some sunlight trying to peek through a little bit. Looking. Right. Stick. And like the folks on Chestnut Avenue got a little souvenir. Five one lead here. Looking. Coming back over. Again, Wright was in position to get a stop. Ball stays with look. With uh, boys lighting the shot clock at 41, the game clock at 10:46. Here left in the first half. What a fine first half it's been too. Look at shoot score! Six straight. What a six straight team in the country. The boys lighting school Lakers. right now. Feeling some of that heat. And they know they gotta pick it up. And the Lakers have dominated the first half here. Pop, finally the Dons get it in their stick here. And they know they gotta make it happen. Oh, that's close. Step back and step over. Pass near midfield. Let's go, Duncan! 10 13 on, remain and a half. That's Duncan in there, right? Coming with the noise, long pass over, back, looking to shoot, shoots and scores, huge, breaks the run up there, the Dons within four. That was a huge score there for the home lawyer, Blakefield Dons. Did we get that major stop there. Again, the playoffs will start today. Gloria Blakefield would be in the fifth position. The loss and the Calvin Hall Gilman game is so huge because McDonough, right now, I think McDonough would have to kind of almost went out to get in. Just because of the fact that some of the teams they lost to tiebreaker wise, it would hurt them right now. One of them was Calvin Hall Friday night in a great comeback. Dawn's trying to. Cut the lead to three here. They're down six to two. They're in the second with nine, 18 left. They're in the first half. Looking. Back. Swings it. Woo! That was a curveball-like shot that went awry in the shot clock at 36. Right now, not as bad now. Slacked up on us a little bit. Need the umbrella. Shot clock at 17. Dons back. Eight, seven, six. 
five, four, three spins out of it, shoots it a low one, and a nice save there. Connor Stroller. As Boys Latin trying to go back up five. There you go. Good serve. Run was cut. The Lakers would love to start it up. Always thanks to Hot Tide to hear Lloyd Blakefield having this come out. In the DMV Springs more series, which we'll be adding a little bit more baseball to the can at all. Coming up here starting on Thursday. Look in, look in. Back, nice shot. Low for right. Ball still alive. And the Dons get it. Couple checks. Let's see Lloyd Blakefield again. Remember lacrosse, no lead is safe. You gotta keep it going. Got it from midfield. Back again. Over. Fifty seconds. He left on the shot clock. Look in. Watch, Duncan, watch! Shot clock at 25. Game clock at 6.39. Boy, uh, has been in attack mode more in the second, but they've spent a lot of time setting things up. 15. 14. 13 seconds on. The shot clock here. Nine, eight, seven, yep. six, five, and Stroller off of his stick blocks the shot. Ball still down. Roy Blakefield picks it up. The Dons get that 60 second clock working in their favor again. Nice. Intercepted. Very nice there. Boys Latin trying to be back in the tech mode. Timeout by the Lakers with five, 55 left. A 6-2 lead here for the sixth ranked team in the country. Thank you so much for checking us out here at the Dice Net. On the Twitter, at Dice Running Net. Got any questions for us? Email us, donstevy22, gmail.com. Cash app us, we always appreciate any donations. We always go back to the Dice Running Network. And for the work of the Dice Running Network. And you can check. And out, Cash App, Dice Running Network, Instagram, Facebook, and here on YouTube, which we are pushing to 1,760 plus subscribers strong. We thank you all so much for it. I mean, we are pushing this up. Right action here in the DMV area, of course. We're going to have some baseball. We'll be at all special curly this time. We'll see them at John Hill, big MIA conference matchup between those teams. And Friday, we are hoping to come at you. We will support a part with a twin bill between Broad and Savannah Park. Or from St. Mary's, be them against Gilman. And then Saturday, we have a baseball twin bill with Calvin Hall in both games. And the first game, the main game, is Spalding against Calvin Hall. We'll have that one for you. Next week, here on DSN, on the girls' side, we're going to bring you some girls across. We don't come at you from Broadneck. I mean, excuse me, from Severna Park. What car are you We're talking? We're at McDonough. They trying to bounce back here up against Linden High School. They team ranked nationally. Oh, good match up there. Let's go, And next week, we're hoping to come at you from uh, St. Paul. We will be at you from Calvin Hall when they play South. A lot of action coming your way here on DSN. And we also have uh, AU basketball coming up in May as well. It's all busy. All right, 555 left here. That's the first half. There it is. Looking. Spins out. The setup. Back. Shot clock at 60. Coming around the mountain. Back. Over. Swings it. No. No. Didn't go. Didn't go. 53 seconds on the. Shot clock here. 
Four boys line. Lane again, kind of. Yes, pick back up a little bit here. Looking, looking, shoot! That was a bit wide, wide. Left here to our Brandis Point! And that one was shot wide as well. 29 seconds. Here left. On the shot clock, 5-11 here left on the game clock in the first half. Looking, looking, looking. Under the legs and scores it! How about that one? That was Jacob Bowen. Nice crafty way there. A new right was looking up for him. He went low and got it under the legs. The lead back to five. Here for boys right. 7-2 game. The Lakers really. We're really getting it on. Hi. Yeah, we would have seen each other like this before. Face off. Coming back around. That day, and it was like sub zero. The wind was, and I remember just being like, God, I'm so bummed. I can't stand it. I'm tired of walking around. But, you know, thanks for that, Ashley. I mean, that thing is really coming to me. It's coming to me. It's coming to me. It's coming to me. It's coming to over. Trying to spin out of it. Behind the back! Yeah. You talk about it, Seth! Puts up 18! Lakers up six! And the Lake Show is running right now here at Lawyer Blakefield. Behind the back pass. And a score in that. Eight two lead now, the Lakers. Ball's gonna go back to Lloyd Blayfield or Dons. As we said earlier, they gotta bring some heat. They're down six goals at home. Look in here. Back. Player 35. Double haul up 6-2 at the break. Seven and Spalding tied. Shot clock is six. Four, three. And throw it up in the air. And here's shot clock violation. He's got to up seven before at the break. They're playing Mount St. Joe trying to get back on the comeback trail. Long one. Woo, what a catch! Over! Boom! That's the one! Nine and two! The Lakers have come into Thompson and dominated the Warrior here in the first half. Shish by Cardi! The goalie! Now, 
what, what a nice dime piece there on us here. I do too, and I will admit this is coming to a bit of a shot. I don't think anybody expected that. In the sense of the total offensive domination. Is down. Oh, yeah. So B against Lawyer. Three seconds. Come on, let's start the clock, guys. Over here. Back. Over. Brings it back. Shoots. That skip wide. Penalty at nine seconds. And the game clock at 206. The shot clock at 59 seconds. Over, that went wide, that's gonna go out of bounds. Who's breaking for the Dons? Goes back to Lori Blakefield. Time out by Lloyd Blayfield. We take one, two, 122 left and a half. The Dons the looking up right now to the Lakers. They're down seven. Back to game action here. The Dons trying to get a little scoring on their side. For the half is over. Shot clock at 22. Coming. Low pass. Scoop back up. Chopped up. Here comes the Lakers. We're down to second left. 42 to be the side. Back. Over. What a nice pass. I think the Lakers took time, they did. 36.3 left, we're gonna stay with you. Nine to a fair. I think to a lot of us, we're, we're all a little surprised here. Dons have been pretty much dominated offensively. Ever since they scored the first goal, they've been outscored nine to one. And the Lakers ranked sixth in the country, showing you why right now. They all that. They did. Boys landing the remaining schedule. Hoping to get to see the Lakers one more time this year. Hopefully we're against Mount St. Joe's or against St. Paul in their rivals in out the year. Again, they got the big showdown. The big showdown next week at St. Mary's. Boys land right now third in the MIA conference. Also, see it was the St. John and into seven in conference. Friday to get the matchup. Get the host, Calvin Hall. Come on, BL! I really can't wait for that one. So Calvin Hall, every game for them is huge. The BL, let's, let's give them credit defensively. They have been outstanding in this one. Really made the Dons not do what they like to do. Back, over, shoot, score! <laughs> 10 to 2! 
The Dons have dropped in goals here against Boys Latin. Not the first time in a bit. The Dons have given up 10 goals and a half. The Lakers here. You know, they had the big win against Spalding and the confidence oozing in and the offense running freely. 13 seconds here left in the half. Oh. <laughs> Almost had the Mason got one on my kid. Seven, six, <laughs> five, four, three, why not? Two, one, and then that, and that's the half. Half time here in Towson. The sixth ranked team in the country. The Lakers rolling through up eight. And we'll be back with the second half here in Towson. Can the Dons get on the comeback too? Well, you gotta look to find out. We'll, we'll see if they do. Come. Third quarter here about to get going here in Thompson and the Dons down by eight here at home. Second half about to begin a little thing they would say the comeback trail begins. Right here on his face off you say. I mean the Lakers offensively couldn't play a much more perfect first half. As they get the ball here to start the second. Lakers offensively putting on a show. Ball came out briefly on the chat, able to get it back. Shot clock at 58. Look in here. Back. Over. Whoop. Nice way to get it back. Thirty three seconds. <laughs> Banging it. A little bit in the face there. So I thought with 18 seconds on it. Look in. Ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, score! Two seconds left. And the side shot gives the Lakers a nine goalie. Come in. Ball came out briefly. And a reset. Right? 
They need this. Check on the side. Coming. Yeah. Oh, what a block. Stays with the Don. Couple checks there, ball out. Still with a chance with a hit for the Don. Now 11-2. Is that right? Mm -mm. No, I didn't. <laughs> I missed it. They Damn it. Come in. They needed to be. Over. When was that? <laughs> right, just, just after the second half here? 30 seconds here left. On the shot clock, 9.06. They left in the third. Ten. No. Got to do something with it. Four, three. Low. And again, stop. Nice stroller. Looking for that combo. Right now, I'm nine goal lead. The Dons side of things. Quiet. Do you think we're playing this game on Lake Avenue right now? Chestnut Avenue. Shot clock at 38. Rain has held up, shoots it! It was low there, where it hits Wright's knee. And the Dons get it back. Slide to get that one. Dons, I know you don't want to get out what you like to do. Good work, boys. The defense of Loy is so good. They have been able to stretch out their defense a little bit. Not just in the middle, but they've been able to cover a lot of the passes. When you see a pass thrown, you're going to see Maroon real close to the ball. And it has done dividends here for the Lakers. Looking, looking. 706 here left in the third. Back. Shoots! A low one for Stroller. He was able to get it. Got yeah. it in there. A second chance. And it on. Down. 11 to 3. That's 7. That's about 8 now. Sorry. Down by 8. 11 to 3. A second chance goal there. Don's go offensive. Got to pick it up a little bit. Let's go, Leo. Let's go, 1 6. Body up. Go, Nick. Let's go, Nick! Oh, it's back right. the boys land there. I'll be on set. Look in. Sixty seconds on the shot clock here. Game clock is six twenty-three. Look in. Shoots a score. That one shot in and it grabbed all of that. Twelve three advantage. Yeah, for the six ring team. Again. Let's 
Let's go one six. Come on, Nick! No, this is an impressive effort here by the Oil Blakefield in this. Really dominate this game. Again, another face-off win for the Lakers. Uh, again, if time is, is bleeded on both sides, it favors the team in the lead. Looking. Shoot scores! Straight shot! The Lakers dominance on offense continues in the second half. Great one time shot and got it to go. 13 to 3. Oh, Dawes, this is not what the doctor ordered here. They were looking for Oh man! Yeah. Oh! Fourteen to three now. Lawyer Blakefield takes time. Five thirty-four left in the third. The Lakers. Right now with the most dominant performance here this season, up by eleven goals. Back to game action in the third. Fourteen to three game. It has been all boys landing this. Finds again. Ball goes back to the Dons here. Shoots! Right now that there! Collar. Long pass, caught in the net again. Look in, back, over a high one. Petromala trying to get number three. That one's got shot one. Twenty six. Second line here in the shot clock. The password from the Lakers has been a great A. Ball checked out a couple of times. Just gonna take a roll. Oh, he got it. Just barely missed. It. Man. Lawyer. Put it back. Don's got to pick it up on offense and quickly. Yeah. What do you want to do? Start jump in! Three forty left. And a third anyway. Over, swings it, back. That one went wide. Ball saved with the uh, Dawn's there. Shot clock at 35, the game clock at 316.
That's the switch thing. Back. Nice shift. Put him off the spot. Look in. Oh, whoa! That's it! The pass was dead. Ball still. Shaq score! Laid it up in there! Dawn stuck the lead at 10. Matt Burnham in attack mode there. A little layup. But it's still a hill to climb here for the Dons in this. Good, Nick A. Not wrong. Casey's right. It's all fiber going to heaven. Two forty two remaining here in this area. Go get a Go get a GB. Find it, Nick. Find it, Nick. I'm looking again. Chats. It's still there. Woo. Ah. God. Hey, look. Scoop it up is the dawn. They're off! They're off! It's hard to... Oh, you're looking... I'm looking at the top. This is one of the only fields that you've got the color, color difference in the top. Because most of them... Look in! Span it! Oh! Back in the... Stick! Nice. And another save by Stroller! Hit there. The goal, it looks like. Let's go, Red. You owe one to your goalie. Talking about getting out of harm's way. <laughs> Calvin Hall all over Gilman right now in that one, 13 to 4. The goal will count, so it'll be fifteen to four. McDonough final all over Mount St. Joe's, rebounding from losing two in a row. They win fifteen to six at Mount St. Joe's. And now St. Paul's penalty though against uh, Lloyd Blakefield. This one, St. Paul's will meet McDonough on Friday. Here go, go! Penalty here. A minute. Game clock, 37 seconds and counting. Back, shoots, yeah. score! <laughs> Don's cut it to 10 again, 15 to 5 now. Let's go, Kyle. You got Liam. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Come on, McDonough yeah. will go over the lawyer. Yeah. This result stands. Come on, man. Gotta go to Spalding Friday. Seven comes here on Tuesday. 
going on Tuesday. And why are we drinking Cava Hall in the Lawyer Blakefield? It's the third after three. It has been all Lakers. Up by 10 goals here, 15 to 5, fourth quarter. We're coming up from Towson. Have you left? Fourth quarter here underway. The penalty still in play here. Donzo down 10 goals. That skips. That should go back to the boys last row. Well, and the penalty has his spot. So St. Mary's, as we're filming, will be about to take place against John Kell. Great luck. Oh, man. Just lost sight of that one. It's okay. Don's get it back. So the result ends. McDonough is going to be the big benefactor and moving out. Look in. Oh! A nice score there. That's number 35. Bill Dawn, a little defenseman on the shot there. Nine goal game still, again. It's a long hill of climb. You get within five goals, then a little more anticipation will happen, but it's a long, long hill. But it's a time. Go cold. And it's good, Parker. Go, 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 go! Got it there. Shot clock not on. Start the clock! Look in. Look in. That's looking nice in the fourth here for Lloyd so far. Push him, push him, push him. Back. Nice save there. Oh, back comes. Boy, Lakers, six. I'm trying to get on the board for the first time in the fourth. 9.50 remaining. Lakers only two defeats, one of them to the number one ranked team in the country. St. John's Cadets in the WCAC. And the other defeat to Severin here last Tuesday. We called it Wild Tuesday in the MIA conference last week. Looking, looking. Eight fifty six remaining. Yes, 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 
Look in and right sides in. Long pass over. Looking, that shot was wide. Ball stays with Lloyd Blakefield, 32 seconds. Here left on the play clock, game clock, right at eight minutes. Back on the other end. side of the net. Right able to corral it back the other way. They said the Dons, they gotta, they gotta do it quick. Seven goes down. Another loss for them. Boys Latin's gonna move back to the two spot. This result happens. And that means Fallen's gonna move up to three. Seven's gonna drop to four. And McDonough and Kelly Hall respectively will move out. Yes, right now, the playoffs started with this six. Great job, Kelly! 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 5.36 remaining. Couple passes at tips. Looking, back, over, that was a long pass. Once. Well, it is baseball season, so that would be safe. <laughs> be safe. Yeah, Duncan! Long pass to the side. Help him, Don, help him! Lakers can just run out the clock here at this point. Another big one for Boys Latin on Friday. He gets Calvert Hall. What a game that's going to be. Goes back down to be off the charts. And the big showdown at St. Mary's on next Tuesday. A little fake and bake. A little slam. Oh, man. Find it, find it, find it. Wait, three, three, three. Coming coast to coast. 
Wow. Tried to yes. drop that one in in a pass. Got it! What is yeah. that? Yeah. Stroller! Long one, caught. Oh, Defense ain't set up yet. Back! Oh, man! Oh. You know, you can see the finish line is wide open. The whole serve. Boys Latin take a time out here. What's that, the MIA 8 conference pitcher as games coming up here on Friday? Again, in all likelihood, we'll be probably yeah. right now. We're coming at you from St. Mary's. These are the games Friday. Cobble Hall at Boys Latin. St. Paul's McDonough, Loyola, and Spalding will be the uh, legendary MIA Gay Conference game of the week. And then of course nighttime, the games will be in day. We will be at St. Mary's. We will know the results of those games. Again, it's huge. And then next week, a big one at Calvin Hall, Emma Spalding. <laughs> Boys Latin at St. Mary's. Spalding 110 6. Yeah. We're hoping to come at you from St. Paul's. John Phil and St. Paul's. Or well, we could be coming at you from friends with Indian Creek, friends in the B Conference. I've seen the Indian Creek B Conference teams this year. Right now it's a three-team race again. Indian Creek up against friends. We could be coming at you from friends with that one. Hey, do you say that? On DSM, Curly. That's like watching. In control right now, right, MIA right. B Conference. He needs, he needs, he needs MIA. He's good. He What up here? 354 remaining. No, he likes to be. Yeah, he, he's not going to No, I'm just saying. Like, yeah, you get the. As Roy right, Blayfield right. gets so the ball yeah, back. He needs to. He does not. Yeah, this is so Back. He's he just, he just sit there. Barker. Over. Fakes. Shoots! All the back! Oh, over the net. Both days. Put it on. 55 seconds remaining. On the play clock. The game clock at 320. Back. Over. No, you need that confidence. You got that big trip going down to Spalding. Shoots! And a skip wide. Ball stays with uh with the Lakers. I mean excuse me, with the Dons. Looking. Back. Shoots. Yes. Nice save again. Stroller. Yeah. An impressive game for him. Look out, look out. Lost it briefly. Got it back for the Lakers. Again, we'll host Calvin Hall on Friday. And what a game that's going to be. Time out. We take one, two, back with the finish. Here in Upper Town. Back in the game action here. Coming down the stretch now, playing the string out. Lakers on offense, one of their passive efforts of the year. Don's here, known for defense. We was here when they played Georgetown Prep and held them to four goals. That ain't no slouch, I'll show you. That's what makes this impressive outing even, even more impressive here for the Lakers. Couple chats. <laughs> 143 remaining. Against St. Murray's and 
John Kell. You'll know that result by the time we come on with this one. Back. Yes. In there. And we'll be coming back to Alley to the hoop. And a nice cherry on type of this nice cake here for the Lakers as they go back up 10. 10 goal lead. This against Boy Latin right in the two spot now. They'll move ahead of Severin. And again, this setting up. If St. Mary's and Boys Latin get through their game Friday, the game next Tuesday, down in Annapolis is going to be a big dukeroo indeed. <laughs> Let Dons get this one. I said get one, one for the road to go here. Again for the Dons. Again in this conference, it ain't easy. As your next game is up. Next game you go up against uh coming. Oh, oh yeah, with another man. save. Next game you get to go to play Spalding. They've been red hot, will you? Get to see the calves. I don't know. Last game of the season at Mount St. Joe's. You get to see them there. 35 seconds remaining. One of the most impressive efforts of the year for Boys Latin. Oh 20 seconds. 19, 18, 17, 16. Gonna do it. The Lakers win this one by 10. A uh, huge one in for the Lakers. Record now at 10 and 2. 5 and 1 at MIA Conference. The Dons are gonna drop to 5 and 7 now. And they're 3 and 4 in the conference. and. What looks good today can switch again on Friday when the teams play. Well, a little break from lacrosse here. We'll be taking it on the baseball diamond. We'll see Officer Curley and John Kell here in the DMV Spring Sports Series. And then Friday we'll be back on the lacrosse field, either at St. Mary's or at Severna Park. But first, We'll see you in Baltimore City on St. Clair Lane with Carol and John Kell. Until then, so long for now. This is Die Sporting Network. What, what, what?